Good day everyone, you're watching RedTube. Welcome to another video. On this video, I'm going to walk you through step-by-step -step instruction on how to troubleshoot a Windows search not working. Now, if you like this video, please make sure you hit the like button. Now, without wasting any time, now let's get started. Now, the first and foremost step which you will have to go ahead and try is you will have to do a right click on your task, um, on the taskbar and click on task manager. And once you click on the task manager, click on more details if you're not able to uh, see any items here and uh, scroll down and look for Cortana. So let's look for uh, Cortana uh, if it has been listed here. Um, what you will have to do here is you will have to go ahead and uh, end Cortana on your computer screen. So you see Cortana here, right click on it and click on end task. Once you do a right click, uh, once you end Cortana, uh, let's uh, see if you can search any items on the Windows search bar. If you are able to search, well and good. You don't have to uh, follow the next step. Now, the second step which you will have to go ahead and try is you will uh, you can go ahead and uh, end the Windows Explorer. Uh, you will have to follow the same step. You will have to do a right click on your Windows taskbar, open Task Manager. Uh, once you open task manager looks look for windows explorer uh, so let's look for windows explorer here uh, what you will have to do is you will have to uh, end the windows explorer uh, on your computer so let me see if i can uh, find windows explorer here So here we have a Windows Explorer. What you will have to do is you will have to do a right click and click on end task. So when you uh, end the Windows Explorer, you will not see anything on the screen. So what you can do is either you can press Windows key on your keyboard or you can go to file and click on run new task and type explorer.exe. Now that, that should open up uh, the Windows Explorer on your uh, computer screen. You will get back the uh, uh, icons which you were not able to see. Now see if that works uh, and try searching for uh, any items or missing items on your using Windows search. If it works, well and good. If not, uh, the next step would be uh, you will have to open services window. In order to open services window, you will have to press Windows and R key simultaneously on your keyboard which will open up up the run window in the run window you will have to type services.msc and hit enter or click on ok on the screen so that will open up the services window this will show up all the services which are running on your computer screen so here you will have to look for windows search uh, you will have to scroll down a bit uh, in order to locate a windows search so right here, what you will have to do is, uh, in, on my case, it is uh, running, uh, Windows search is running. So what you will have to do is you will have to do a right click and go to properties. Under properties, um, you will have to click on automatic from the drop down and click on automatic and click on start. Click on apply and then click on OK and uh, try to restart your computer and try to search for um, any items using um, Windows search. If this step works well and good, you're good to go. Now, if this doesn't work, the next step would be uh, you will have to open a control panel on your computer screen. On the run window, you can go ahead and type control. That will open up the control panel on your computer screen. And in, once you have all the items listed here, uh, what you will have to do is you will have to look for uh, indexing options. So let's, uh, if you're not, in case if you're not able to search, uh, look for indexing option, what you can do is you can search for indexing option here and uh, click on indexing option. And under indexing option, you will have to click on advanced. So uh, once you click on advanced, you have something called a troubleshooting delete and rebuild index so what you will have to do is you will have to go ahead and re, uh, delete and rebuild the index what this will do is uh, it will delete the existing indexed items on your computer and try to rebuild the um, 
uh, rebuild the index for your Windows 10 machine. Now, this step is going to take a while. Uh, it depends on the amount of data what you have on your computer, and it also depends on the performance of your computer screen. So, once you click on Rebuild Index, what it will do is it will give you a prompt which says rebuilding the index might take a long time to complete. Some views and search results might be incomplete until rebuilding is finished, which means that until and unless the re uh, uh, index uh, is uh, rebuilt completely you will not be able to search any items or in case if you search any items you may not find the relevant results for the items which you have searched in your uh, windows search so please make sure you, uh, you wait until the indexing is complete and then try to search for your uh, uh, items which you have searched so once you click on ok uh, what it will do is it will go ahead and uh, try to rebuild indexing completely on your computer okay so if this once the rebuilding is completed if your search works well and good in case if this doesn't work uh, let's try another step so let me walk you through the next step here so another step is on the same window uh, if you look at the indexing option uh, currently uh, uh, you see that the ind items has been indexed so it is not recommended to try another step um, uh, unless the indexing is complete so once the indexing is complete since it is going to take a long time uh, i'm going to for the demonstration purpose i'm going to use this step so i'm going to click uh, you will have to click on modify under modify make sure all the directories uh, from the location has been select in my case the c drive has not been selected so it is uh, recommended to go ahead and select um, the c drive uh, for the uh, for the indexing to complete so click on ok and uh, that should uh, and then try to search for um, the items in your um, using windows search if all the steps what you have seen so far doesn't work for you uh, the next step would be you will uh, on the same window itself you see an option called troubleshoot search and indexing option so what you can do is you can go ahead and click on troubleshoot search and indexing option so that will open up a window which says that uh, search and indexing detecting problems so uh, let's wait until we get a next window here so on this item you will see uh, what problems do you notice select all that apply or you can select files don't appear in the search results this is the one yes i have uh, since um, i would consider this as one of the option or email doesn't appear in case if you're not able to search items in the outlook you can go ahead and select this one and uh, search or indexing is slowing down slowing down the computer or um, or you can select option which says my problem is not listed above select any of these and click on next so that this will try to detect the problems on your computer now on the next window what you will see is try troubleshooting as an administrator so i would go ahead and select try troubleshooting as an administrator select the items here click on next so this should uh, fix your indexing or search items um, on your computer screen which says that incorrect permissions on windows search directory um, now this has been fixed so uh, if this works well and good you're good to go in case if this doesn't work uh, there's another step which you can also try um, let's go ahead and try the next step so now you can go ahead and close this window um, if you are able to search any items in your windows 10 you're well and good you're good to go if that doesn't work uh, this is the next step which you can try uh, this is a little bit uh, advanced so what you will have to do is you will have to look for a powershell on your computer uh, in case if you're not able to find powershell you can go ahead and type powershell in this run window that should open up uh, the powershell on your run window in the command prompt uh, in the powershell window you will have to do a right click on it and click on edit and click on paste you will have to go ahead and type this command which uh, where you will have to go ahead and unstra unrestrict uh, some of the execution policies and hit enter so once the um, Po uh, execution policies has been set as unrestricted the next step would be you will have to go ahead and copy this command i will also mention this command line in the description window uh, and uh, press ctrl v or you can do a right click on it and click on edit and click on paste so hit paste and hit enter so what it will do is it will try to deploy uh, some of the packages on your windows 10 machine and uh, 
once this has been done uh, you can go ahead and restart your computer and see if uh, you're able to search items in your uh, Windows 10 um, machine in case if this work uh, you're good to go your uh, you, you should be able to search any items on your Windows 10 machine now in case if uh, all the steps what I mentioned here uh, works for you do let me know leave me a comment and let me know what step has been worked for you so that it will be help uh, so that it helps the other users or other viewers who have been looking for a solution so I hope uh, this video is helpful for you guys and I hope uh, this fixes your uh, Windows 10 search problem in case if you have any issues do leave me a comment in case if it if this issue works if the steps works or not uh, do leave me a comment and please do not forget to hit the like button in case if uh, this video has been helpful for you I will be uh, uh, uploading more videos on um, computer fixes in case um, and you can also leave me a, a question in case if you have any computer problems on the uh, discussion uh, section on my channel page you can leave me a question so that I can uh, respond to you back with the necessary solution um, thank you for watching and uh, please do not subscribe to my channel do stay connected for more uh, troubleshooting videos thank you have a great day